as you can see, um, of the retail chains in the top 1,000, nearly 80% by the end of the pandemic were offering uh, in-store pickup of online orders and in-store returns, both uh, considerably higher than before the pandemic. Uh, very importantly, a lot of them, more than two-thirds of these retail chains, now show on their websites how much inventory they have in store, which is really important because you don't want to go to the store and find out they don't have what you uh, went to the store for. Um, it's also the other thing that really exploded early in the pandemic was curbside pickup because consumers were reluctant to go inside uh, stores. Uh, in 2020 and 2021, it really grew. But this turned out to be challenging, for, particularly for smaller retailers that don't have dedicated parking spots they can direct consumers to. So it began to tail off a little bit in 2022. And I suspect that going forward, we'll see that curbside pickup, pickup remains um, a, a, a good offering for retailers in certain categories and maybe not in others.